<laughs> Yo, we're back again with the messy hair. Hey, what up? Uh, let's be 14. Uh, gonna shift gears a little bit today. Recently uh, changed, or I guess altered some of my workouts while increasing the amount of work. Stop it. Stop it, stop it, stop it, you. No one is scared of you. You are a walking bratwurst, okay? You're not scary, cut it out. That's my dog cheesecake, sorry. Cheers! Get over here. You're the one that's really scared. All right, so yeah, uh, besides altering some, I also increased the amount, so we're gonna see how that goes. After about a year and a half of constantly working out, uh, either working out every day or working out for the amount's worth of every day, uh, been getting good results, but just got to stay consistent, stay to the drive. That, that's been the main thing, been the key to success so far, is just building up that consistency from a small amount. Uh, you know, I didn't expect to move mountains overnight, so I didn't try and overdo it. Uh, I've done it that way in the past, and I mean, it's just for me personally, it might be different for, for other people. Having an explosive start is great until you can no longer be consistent. Keeping that, that dedicated drive will keep you going. Because once... You are, you hit that first obstacle, uh, that first adversity of, well, A, not wanting to do it because the day of the first day of breaking the cycle of continually working out, that it's, it's hard because you're going to be sore. You're going to, you're going to have that mental blockage. You're not going to want to do much. You want to stay in bed, but you got to push through that. Uh, but yeah, that, that would be step one, uh, two would be missing that day. But when, once you break that cycle, it's, it's hard to hop back into that mentality because the mentality is key. Um, sure, there's certain individuals, uh, I mean, other individuals that set up a schedule, you know, where it's like work out one day, rest the next day, and they go hard. And that works for some people. Uh, personally, for me, that doesn't necessarily work. Uh, I need something that's consistent. Uh, working out every day is nice. That's uh, that's what works for me. So I am building that workout regimen around that. It's been going well. Uh, the main thing that my goal is for this year to improve would be uh, my back, my back and shoulders. I'm trying to do more pull-ups. Uh, that will do wonders. That That's the main thing that, uh, I mean, it's partly an avoidance because I could have created the means to do so. There was means to do so before, especially before I moved, but everything was situational. Uh, how I would do in the past, when I was earlier in this workout, I would do pull-ups at the local park. Now there's gym, so I can use that, uh, and I do that sometimes. Besides that, uh, yeah, it's just the mental blocks to do it and that uh yeah just been getting back into stocks seeing what i can do there and taking a, taking a break from those for a while trying not to focus on it but now that i've had more time uh, i've been able to get back into it try and see if i can do stuff there i've had some good okay growth but uh we'll see we'll see what this near future is. i have a few options going so We'll see how those turn out. You know, I'm excited, excited to see those as I've gotten better as a trader.